the immediate aftermath of this? Who, who intervened? Were efforts made to try to keep uh, the boy who's now being sought inside the premises? Were other teachers involved? Or what, did other pupils try to help? No, as I, as I said in my statement, the students immediately left the school site. Could well, you tell us why you chose to keep the school open for that? Because I think it's important, as Mr. Weller has already referred to, that we make sure there's consistency for our students because the students need to be safe and secure. And that support from staff and other members of the community on site to make sure our students are being well looked after today. And as I've said already, they've responded to fantastic maturity. What, what can you leave with a knife in his hand in all of the knife or one? That's what the police are looking into that at the moment. What, what contacts have been made to the, with the suspect's family and how are they? How's your relationship and communication with them? Well, the communication with the suspect's family is all in through the police. You don't have that question to them. Have you made any changes to the school day at all? And anything in response? The advice from the police at the moment, and then we're used to dealing with these incidents as we keep things as well. Have you spoken to children? I know you've, you've phoned some parents. Have you addressed well, we, any of the children or done anything to make sure? We have spoken to the students about the incidents taking place this morning. We've also contacted the parents via the website and also we've sent a text message to parents. So there's information. What are your so normal security measures? Some parents have said to us they came to school because you contacted them. Others have said that they hadn't heard it, just, just knew about it from the news. Have you taken a different approach depending on whether their children witnessed what, what happened? Yes, yeah, so the students who have witnessed what has happened are being dealt with by the police at this stage. And their parents? Their, their parents were obviously the priority early on. In the first time, as you can understand, our priority was A, the member of staff and the students who have witnessed it. We have subsequently been communicating with all our parents. Bearing in mind, you must know who this boy is. What appeal would you make to him? Well, I think the best thing for him to do is obviously to be doing so. Um, well, the, the site is secure, but um, you know we don't have um, we don't have random searches of students. If that's, what you're, if that's what you're asking. Um, I think uh, have weapons been found in this school no, before? No, it's the first weapon we've had. Are you under? Do you understand this knife was brought in, or it was somehow acquired within the school? I was saying it was brought in today. Do you have any indication of why this 14-year-old boy would want to stab his teacher? I think his motives are being looked into by the police again at territory. Is it his time. form teacher that he's stabbed? No. He tells what subjects the teacher taught. Not this subject. Did the student have any contact with anyone else as he left the school? Did anyone try and restrain him as he left the building? Not from the location. Of the is it possible to just walk out of the school once the school day is actually yeah. running? As Mr. Weather said, the site is secure. However, all fences can be scaled. No. But just the doors even? Aren't the doors locked? How far away is this school? Is anyone in the school? If this 14-year-old boy is still missing, how can you feel confident that the school is still safe and secure? Well, you've seen the police presence here. This is probably the safest place to be for those children. This is probably the safest place to be. Have you had disciplinary issues in this I think if we do anything that comments on, on the child or the need to be identified, we have to avoid that. To what extent are you concerned that he might be arrested himself? Or just see us or something like that. That is a concern. Are there any other children in school who have been accused of being acquired in the cases of this boy's going on? Have you conducted all the interviews they need to be done? Do you mind us for those who are in the school? Yes, sir. Just keep your name and what happens with the individual organics. Well, I think we'll review that everything we do, but there are some things that have been just kind of helpful. Just to clarify. But again, anything to do with the investigation will be advised by the police, we should stay clear of those questions. How do you feel? Well, we obviously have an office that will be set sharp. Councillors on, on site by the other local council and if anybody needs things that's all that they get. But the staff and the students in this building are tremendous and they're working. How are the students who have been witnesses of
Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.